Hello, Dwellers, and welcome to Rayman Legends, the demo, because it hasn't come out yet. And so the demo just came out. And uh, I don't know if you guys have ever played a game called Rayman Origins, but uh, this is the sequel to that. And Rayman Origins is a really amazing game. And I wanted to uh, play Rayman Legends a bit and just have some fun. So, are you ready? I sure am. Oh my. So what's really cool here is that, as you can see, we have little Rayman right here. And he can jump and he can do all his little dances and bam. Pew, 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 pew. And I accidentally just jumped in there, but uh, we're going to be doing all of these things. So that's a good thing anyway, right? <laughs> Uh, but the only thing I don't like is the loading times are kind of too long for my opinion, but the game itself is amazing So as you can see there's a very nice fancy cutscene going on this dragon apparently has stolen lots of people things are on fire the whole place is just in disarray and ooh, This camera must be really really fancy look at this camera work. I don't know how they did this Did they mount it on a moose? I bet they mounted it on a moose, but here's Rayman in all his glory. Now he can dance and do stuff. So as you can see, uh, Rayman is a platformer. I'm sure a lot of you guys know that already. And your objective is to co uh, collect these guys called Looms. Or Lums. I forgot how they're pronounced, but it is L-U-M-S. And his hair can become a jetpack. Or not a jetpack. A propeller. Dude, I wish my hair could turn into a jetpack. That'd be awesome. Um, but uh, it's just like a little platformer thing. And... Uh, Ooh, I just found a secret area. As you can see, there's lots of people here. And he's running in place. Oh, I missed some. I missed some. Here. Oh, no. Come back. No. Yes. Woo. Woo-hoo. Who are you? I saved this guy. I did it. I think I saved him. I think I saved him. And he gave me a heart. And I just run in place to show him how happy I am. And he's like, woot woot, fist bump. But uh, the cool thing about the Wii U, as you guys probably have already know from the, uh, the review, is that you actually use the touch screen to uh, play games with it. And so we're switching over to Murphy right here. He's actually going to help me with the, as you can see, you can see my touch. This is me touching um, the screen. Murphy right here. Yeah. Mm. Oh yeah, look at this Murph in your face. But uh, what Murphy does here is he is uh, used to help control the characters. Uh, you can use it to manipulate things in the foreground, background, whatever. I'm supposed to kill this guy. Oh, he's dead. Uh, over to you, Murphy. That's the guy's name. I'm supposed to hold this guy and make him ticklish. And then while he's in a tickle fit, he dies. Which is pretty freaking cool. Um, so here we go. And I got to cut this rope. And then I got to pop these things with my finger. I got to flip the switch. Don't got to do nothing here. He can jump. And then I can swoosh these guys, make them all fancy. Look at that. We're doing good. I mean, this is like a tutorial level, but still. Got that. Got that. Oh, oh man. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. He flapped his wings. Did you see that? Oh my goodness. Come here. Oh. I'm helping him. So I have to move these platforms up and down. As you can see, it can be kind of trolly. Um, he only jumps when there is good enough, you know, he's going to make it. So he's not stupid. Now, another thing is, is that I'm actually tilting the gamepad to move this. So as you can see, he's going up here. I'm going to let him get that guy and go into the secret room. Oh, yeah, good job, man. Oh, boy. Okay. So now I have to rotate this until he makes it safely down. And then... Oh, come on. You can do it, Murph. You can do it, Murphy. Come on. Oh, I have to do this. Okay. Man. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. Come on. You can do it. I can mew wall jump. That's not fair. Okay, and then you have to rotate him like this. And then... Oh, is he... Oh, he made it. Good job. And he pooped out the guy. Great. So everyone's happy. The guy gave him a heart. And he's like, oh, cool. Well, I guess I can go back the way I came now. And then we have to hold this guy down. Got to rotate this some. Let him grab on. Jumped up there. 
Oh, he's making... Oh, there's a spider in my face. Did you see that spider? I did. Okay, cut the ropes. Cut this rope first so we can go back here. Oh, what's over here? Oh, a guy. Hostage. Those spiders are scary. They're like ticks. Look at them all over the place. Okay, gotta get this guy. Gotta get this guy. No, come on. Yeah. Okay, now we gotta pop that. Move that. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, boop. Whoa. Look at him being fancy pants. Fancy pants adventure. Bam. Boom, boom. And then you're good. Oh, that was a close one. Get the tickle guy. Tickle fight. Tickle fight. Get the tickle fight. Oh, he's so funny. Oh, he's dead. And then poke the eye and we're, we beat the level. We beat the level. I don't know what happened to Rayman. I guess he just went on vacation, but this other guy beat the level. Isn't that great? Teensy's in trouble. So then we've got... Oh, I really want to do this one right now. So before we do that, um, we're just going to jump into here and the collection of heroes. And this lets you switch who you're playing as, which is really cool for a demo. I like playing as this girl because she has an axe and kill stuff, so let's go in here. So now I am her, and as you can see, I'm Viking Gal. I don't know what her name is, but she can even do that. Yeah, so that's pretty cool. So let's go back and, uh, you know, play this a little bit. And we're just going to go to my favorite one, the Castle Rock. Now, what's really cool about this whole level is it's in sync with the music. And it's just really amazing. So, here you go. You ready for the experience? I'm going to try to be quiet mostly through it. So it's just telling you to start. We're about to start. Ready? Here we go. Gotta jump on time with the music. As you can see, the uh, guitar little things are actually stretches of rope. And drums are bombs. Really, really cool. Rayman is really, you know, it has a lot of personality. Oh, I missed him. Um, but uh, really just love the personality. I love the art style. And it's just a really great, impressive, pretty game. You can tell that they, the guys who made this had, like, a lot of fun. Because I'm having a lot of fun just playing the level. Oh, the dragon's trying to eat me. Oh. Yeah! Come on, you can make it! Boom. This is great. Oh. Bam! 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 Oh, it's slowing down. That means it's the end of the song! Let's finish it with a guitar solo. Or axe solo, because he's literally using an axe instead of the guitar. But the dragon's dead. We won! Anyway, I'm not going to do the one in between because it's just basically the same, uh, except it uses the floating mechanic of Rayman a lot more. Uh, this one right here, Toad Story. And uh, I want you guys, if you have a Wii U, to download this demo, try it out, and see what you guys think. I personally love it a lot, and when the game comes out, I will definitely buy it. Because I love Origins, and this one's... Oops. <laughs> this one's even better. Anyway, guys, as we're loading, I'll talk to you guys later. See ya.